In this tutorial, you'll learn how to make a GIF uh, animation uh, an x ray scanner. Okay, we'll start with a face uh, picture and we'll crop it uh, to the same size as the skull. I've copied and pasted a uh, skull picture in one of the layers. Uh, reduce the opacity down to 50% so we can see uh, the skull against the uh, face. And we'll just go to the move tool and move the skull layer to center it. Uh, turn off snap if you, or it's going to snap to the grid. Go to bucket and fill in with black. On the skull layer, make a square selection and go to transform warp. And here we can uh, uh, shape the uh, skull to better fit the uh, face. We'll fix the nose area by using the uh, lasso tool to make a circular selection and go back to warp and then we'll just uh, zoom in and uh, shape the uh, skull to match the uh, nose of the face. And go to apply and you'll see there's cut marks there. We've got to fix that. And we can just do that by uh, using a paintbrush. Uh, on the skull layer, tr turn the opacity up to 100% here when we're fixing things. And we'll get the diff different colors with the eyedropper and we'll fill in those areas. With the uh, small fuzzy paintbrush. Just use the eyedropper and paintbrush tool. Now we have to, uh, we should go to a blur. We can go to blur to bl the blur tool and turn it to 100% and soften the edges. Fill the cut mark above the skull, the black area, with a black foreground. Now we'll use warp uh, for the bottom of the skull to shape the uh, the teeth area and the the sides of the jaw and just match that up closely and apply and zoom in and there's more cut marks that have to be fixed turn off the face layer and on the skull layer size up the brush and with the black foreground and it'll smooth out the areas and we can clean that up with the fill Okay, now we'll get the x-ray effect. Turn the skull opacity to 100% and its mode to multiply. Add a layer mask, hide all. Click the layer mask and put a selection there and just fill it in with a white foreground. And that'll just create a transparent uh, area. And you can use the shift and up and up and down arrow keys to uh, 
to move the uh, the transparent area over the face. Like that. Now we'll make a more narrow uh, crop here. And I'll size it down so that it'll fit uh, inside the uh, screen area of the uh, of the background which I'll show in just a minute and the screen dimensions are 236 by 354 and there's our background uh, with the transparent uh, screen select it all and you can see the dimensions there and copy and go back to the first uh, project tab and we'll change the canvas size to the size of the uh, whole uh, background uh, picture which was 272 by 540 And then we just have to paste paste the screen. Now the skull, I press uh, shift and get the skull and face layer together to center it. I'll start doing some frames. Uh, we'll copy that and put it into an, uh, another project of the same size. And we'll go to the, the Move, click the Skull Mask, and Shift and Down Arrow twice. Copy it again, Copy Merge, Paste. Now we've got uh, two frames already and we just need the rest. Okay, I created 15 frames. Uh, we can uh, delete the uh, uh, background. Now we'll go to Window, Animation, and then we get uh, an animation bar down there. We want to copy all the, frame, all the layers into frames. Make frames from layers and then you can uh, test it and it runs real fast so we don't have any delays on it so using shift group group select the 15 frames and right click and put it to point zero one and now it's running not not too fast uh, copy them again and yeah we want to copy all the frames I uh, click on the on the last frame paste after selection now we have 15 more and we just want to reverse go to re reverse frames And then you can test it and the scanner will go up and down in a forever loop. Okay, now we'll uh, save it. Save for web and devices under file. And we can preview it if you want. Just click preview. And it'll show you what it look, look it'll look like if it's on a web page. And we want to save it as a GIF. Cut it down to fifty percent. Check my tutorial out at my website if you want more uh, detailed information.